A fake to Breida. A roll from Jones. He stumbled. He regained his footing. He runs for a first down. Daniel Jones makes something happen. 2 and 0 oh, baby. 2 and 0. Oh. Ugly win, but I'll take it. Was expecting a little bit more points scored against this Carolina team, knowing that Baker Mayfield is not that very good. But a win's a win, and that's all that matters. Brian Dayball and Joe Shane has come in and turned the culture around in this building within months. This team is believing in itself. Saquon Barkley is believing in his in itself. Daniel Jones is protecting the ball a lot more. He didn't have a good game today, but he had no turnovers. He almost had an interception, but he, the guy on the Carolina couldn't catch it. And that's the end of it. We're 2-0. We won the game on our own terms, on, on Neil, and we didn't have to rely on anyone missing a kick or whatever. We won the game. Our first home game of the year, Brian Dable's home opener. Brian Dable starts his coaching career 2-0. And it's just, it's great. It's great knowing that even with the injuries of losing Leonard Williams, hopefully he's okay. He left the game with a knee injury. No Wandale Robinson. Kenny Galladay is a complete waste of time and money and talent. And I hope that he gets cut soon or traded for even a seventh round pick. Um, no Aziz Ashalari. No Kayvon Thibodeau. But we managed to put our foots down, our heads down, and work and grind. And we won. And we were 2-0 because of that. And... Just hats off to Brian Dayball. He knows how to push all the right buttons. He gets after the offense when they're playing piss poor and performing on a terrible level. We should have started the game 14 up of that opening kickoff fumble and then the, the next play of fumble. We settled for three. It is what it is, but these are the games that we have to learn from. You have to score touchdowns when you're in the red zone, and that's just, that's just all it is. That's all there is to it. Score touchdowns. We wouldn't have been in a close fourth quarter game. But regardless, we won, and that's all that matters. I am thrilled. I am happy. Daniel Jones needs to play a lot better. I'll admit that right now. As of now, he, has he done enough to impress me to want him back next year? Uh, not really. But, again, that third and six to end the game, Jones took it with his feet, and that's all that matters. He saw that no one was open. He managed to keep the ball and take the win for himself, and he did. And because of that, we are 2-0. I couldn't be happier. Right now, my son can be born right now because I'm just so happy. 2-0, let's go. Let's fucking go, Giants. Enjoy the win. Let's root for Dallas to lose and that the Eagles lose Monday night. And let's go into week three, primetime game against the Dallas Cowboys, and let's take it to them. Let's fucking go, Giants. Giants fans, enjoy the rest of your week. And I'll stay up and stay tuned for more information. Enjoy your day, man, because now we can sit back, relax, and know that the Giants are in first place of the NFC East. And we are 2-0. As always, guys, stay blessed, stay safe, and let's go G-Men.